Okay, just a little warning. The middle of this video is consumed with going through this big stack of Ideal magazines. I mean, don't get me wrong, they're really pretty, but you might want to fast forward through some of it. I'm just warning you because at the end of the video, I show some magazines that have stamps that go with them. So I didn't want you to get bored and click off. That's all I'm saying. Okay. Here's hey y'all, it's Kristen, and I've got a few things to show. This first thing is from my friend Candy. She got this for me. I have the papers, but I didn't have the uh, cards, so we're going to go through these right quick. They're really pretty. There's the backs of them. So pretty. I love his stocking. I don't think there's one in here that I don't like. Love the house. Look at the house on the back. I'm a little bit closer than I normally am because I moved my setup a little bit. And now I can't get it back like it was. That's the other side. I love that one right there. Hopefully there's not a shadow either. There's the back of that one. I think these fold in half or something. I know on the other ones they did. There's the back. There's the backs of those. Or maybe these are the ones that fold in half. I don't know. Yeah, I think so because that would be that back. That's so cute. Look at that postcard right there. And then the back is another postcard. Let me see something. Okay, so look. There's that. And it says this, this side for the address. Hopefully, you guys can see. And then I love this one. And then the back is like that, where the stamp goes and everything. And then there's smaller ones. <coughs> there's the backs. There's the tags. And the circles. All right. So, thank you, Candy. I really love it. All right, I went to my aunt's this weekend, and she found me some doilies, and I love them. So there's one. I think this one's the same. And then we have this one. I love the turquoise. And we have this one. And a purple one. Oh, there's two. Oh, three purple. All right. Cool. And then we have this kind. It's bigger. With the red on the edge there. And then... Let me move those over. This is really big. Can you see that? Very, very pretty. All right. So those are very nice. Then, of course, I went on eBay. You know, you guys know how I am about eBay. And I got a whole bunch of Ideal magazines. Actually, I don't know how many I got. I don't know. There's like 15 here. So we're just going to quickly go through these. There's some titles that I've never, that I didn't know they had. So we're going to just look through them. This is Autumn. And look, they have the pullout in the back. I don't know how I feel about those. <clears throat> So real quick, the ship. Hopefully I'm not too close. Kind of feel like I am. Oh, I gotta look at that. Isn't that nice? Oh, I'm not even gonna check the dates of these because, well, actually, yes, I will. But more than likely, it's Roman numerals. Yep, it sure is. Okay. The next one is an Easter one. Again. Ooh, they got a purple pullout. Ooh, look at that. Luckily, I know how to edit. Ooh, baby chicks. I mean, ducks. Oh, good lord. 
Oh my goodness, okay. This looks like a 70s, maybe. I know I'm going a little fast, but and that's pretty. Ooh, look at the tulips. All right, so the next one, this is one I didn't know they had. It's called Advent the Adventure Issue. I'll look at the date. I didn't look at the date of the other one, but I would just kind of guessed. Let's see here. Mm -mm. Nope. So there's pullouts again at the back. Amelia Earhart. Ooh, what's this? Some kind of book page. Huh. Look at that little girl. Cool. Alright, so there's that one. We have a Christmas one because I needed some Christmas stuff. Or some Christmas book pages. Ooh, there's a pull-out thing in the front. Ooh, this one's not Roman numerals. 1971. Yay. Okay. Lovely. Okay. So there's that one. Here's an Easter issue. And I don't know. Look at that. Okay. That looked like about the 70s, too. A Thanksgiving one. Ooh, look. Pullouts with, for Christmas. Yay. All right. Let's see here. Yeah, I don't know. <clears throat> Actually, I can't really see anything. No glasses. For the new people who do not know about me leaving my glasses everywhere I... Ooh, that's nice. I leave my glasses places I don't really need them. And then when I do need them, I can't find them. Anybody else do that? I'm pretty sure I asked that one time before. This one is um, old-fashioned. I've never heard of this one either. That one feels like it's never been opened, too. Yeah, I think that I bet these are all around the 70s. Oh, those are paper dolls. Look at that. Selena, those are the books you were, or a type, the McDuff, McGuffey's Second Eclectic Reader. Didn't you have those kind of books in your kits, or you had them in a kit that you just did? Cool. All right, next one is Mother's Day. Again, I'm going to say 70s. Actually, I'll just stop repeating myself. I don't know. Maybe. Oh, that's pretty. All right, so there's that one. Here's another one that's old-fashioned. Hopefully this is not boring to y'all. Let me see. I don't think there's anything I don't like about these magazines. I mean, they're great. Everybody's doing. Oh, that's pretty. Okay. This one is called the Inspiration Issue. Oh, how cute. 
cute. All right. This one's called Woodland. This one's another old-fashioned one. It's a little bit thicker than the other ones. Let's see. 1956. Cool. Ooh. All right, let's see. This paper is different, too. It's like a textured... Um, it almost feels like canvas. That's exactly what it feels like. Ooh, music. Yay. A lot of pages of it. What was that? I think maybe it feels like canvas because these are paintings. Very nice. This book is hard to... Yeah, look at that. Oh, that's cool. Bicycle days. Another busy people page. Allison. Oh, look at this one. This one's going to take a minute. Let's look at it together. Oops, am I in frame? Okay, hopefully you can see the whole thing. This is really nice. Oh, there's Christmassy. Okay. This one's countryside. pretty. Okay. And then this one's called The Liberty Issue. I deals remember its booklets. Hmm. Excuse me. All right, so there's that one. This one's Valentine. Whew. Oh, isn't that pretty? Cut those up. Wait, I gotta read that. You're such a turn. <laughs> that one. <laughs> oh my goodness, that's funny. Okay. Oh, those are pretty too. All right. Another Valentine 
we got to hurry because i got to show something else, too. Can't get too distracted by the Ideal magazines. This is a Thanksgiving one. Oh, isn't that gorgeous? This one uh, it says Family Issue Ideals, which I love the cover. Oh. We have another Christmas one for Santa. All right. And the last one is a fireside issue. Nineteen seventy eight. So I think we have like two that we could actually know the date. Oh, cool. Alrighty then. The next things I want to show, I actually was watching Rhonda over at uh, Little, Ron Little Rhonda Lee. Hi, Rhonda. I will link her channel down in the description box. She was showing um, a Happy Mail that she got, and she was she got uh, this one, I believe. It's a paper crafter magazine. It's got stamps in it, so I'm going to open these. And we're going to look at them. I've got two Christmas ones and then one, uh, this one, the butterfly one. Let's see. How does this open? I guess I should have done this. I always say that. I should have done that before I started the video. All right, so here's the magazine. This one is simply cards. I wonder, I don't know. We'll look at all the magazines and see if they're named the same things or what. So these are actually, uh, dies and at least I think that's what that is. I don't use dies very often. Yeah, stamp and die. So these are dies. There's a butterfly, you see. And then we have all of these stamps. With the magazine, which I'm not going to go through the magazine, but you could get some really nice inspiration from here. Okay, so I got that one. And then, I'm going to save that one for last because it's my favorite. We got this one. So what was the name? Let me see what the name of this one was. Simply Cards and Paper Craft. This one's Card Making and Paper Craft. And let's see what we have here. Oh, Kaiser Craft Paper. Yay, look at this. Isn't that beautiful? I hope these colors are showing up. I can't get a 
it. Okay. Some cut aparts. Some borders. Very nice. Alright, so we have that. And then we have some stamps. And what is this? What is, hang on. What is this? You get a stamp set. Oh, it's an embossing folder. Okay. Foiled paper designs. What's the, what is the foiled paper designs? Is that in with this? I don't know. I'll have to look in this magazine. Let me open this to see what's what. Oh, here we go. Wow, those are really pretty. Cool. So we have that, and then the embossing folder and the stamps. All right. And then this is the magazine. But like I said, we're not going to go through it because it would take a very long time. Oh, those are nice. What is this? Six ideas for your bonus papers. Huh. So they're magazine, uh, but they're you can cut them up. There's some cut aparts down here and there. Hmm. Aren't those pretty? What is this? Craftcreations.com. Look at those. Hmm. I'll be going through that. And then this one is the one that Rhonda was showing. What made me go up there and go crazy. I got these on eBay. Did I say that? I don't remember. Hopefully you can read all the words. And then, look at this. It's like a Christmas village or something. When I saw that, I was like, oh, I want that so bad. Isn't that great? I love the houses. And the lamppost. I mean, I love all of it. So nice. So this one's called the Paper Crafter. So the other ones were like Simply Cards and something else. I don't know. We'll just... But I wouldn't mind getting a magazine like this every month or however often you get this. Oh, I think these are the extra papers. Yep. I mean, with all the extra stuff in it, I don't know if that happens every time you get a magazine, whether it's, you know, it's every three months or every month. I don't know. But that would be nice to get something extra every time. All right, so that is it for right now. I've got some process videos that I'm going to do where I'm going to be decorating some traveler's notebooks. I hope you like this video. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already. And thank you so much for watching.